In this tutorial, I'll show you how to edit overexposed photographs in Photoshop. So, let's get started. Go to File, Open and select the image. Open this in Photoshop. So, as you can see, this photo is too much overexposed. We are missing some details, so let's fix that out. So here is the layer and click on the channels. Here you can see blue channels, green, red and RGB. Now hold control and click on the RGB channel. Now go back to the layers. So what it does, this make a selection of the brighten area of these photographs. Now press Ctrl J to put this selection into a new layer. Now hide the background layer you can see. So this is the brighten part of these photographs. Now make this visible and change this layer mode normal to multiply. Multiply is a such blend mode which make things darken. So if you think this is not good enough you can go ahead and make a copy of this layer press ctrl j now hold shift and select these these both layers and press ctrl j to make a group now you can see the before and the after the before and the after so our basic correction is done now go to the next steps so now I want to give a soft dreamy color effect to these photographs so let's start now click the adjustment layer and select vibrance so this image is too much vibrance so let's de decrease it decrease the vibrance a little bit I think minus 20 around is good now click here and go to the channel mixer switch to the green channel and in the green put the value 0 and the blue 100 go to the blue channel in the blue 0 and the green 100 now close it and change the blend mode normal to lighten now you can see this is before and this is after now click here and choose selective color now here a lot of color you can play with now click on the blacks so where the black in these photographs this area the shadow area here here and here so i'm gonna apply a cyanish color effect to the blacks apply the cyan to the blacks as you can see now go back, click on the whites so in the whites area i'm gonna give a magenta a reddish color not too much i think that should go good enough now click on the reds i want a red color effect to the highlight area decrease the cyan you can get the red color effect because of cyan is the opposite of red rgb opposite of cmyk so i think that's good enough now close it now you can see the before and after a nice color composition now in the final step I'm gonna play with the contrast now click here choose curves make it dark here and just a bit close this now now you can see the before and after now i don't want the 
face of her not get dark enough so click on the curves mask here masks thumbnail and choose brush and in the color choose black is a foreground color and select a round soft brush and make a click of her face to get rid of the black and here just now you can see the before and the now hold alt and see the overall before and after so here is this is this was the original image and this is the after before and after so i hope that you would enjoy this tutorial and don't forget to subscribe